Hi everybody. Um, I just thought I'd record this video because um, this this is extremely important to me and for people to see this video and to understand how it is and how it feels and um, what it's like to come out as a gay person. I think it's extremely important and um, and the it's get it gets better project is really really helpful and you know if you go on it and if you're struggling to come out and if you're scared and um you don't know what people will say and um, you don't know how you know you don't know how you like know, walk in the street you don't know how people look at you you know if you're scared of that even you know that it helps you so much so i mean i came out before this was set up so um but I still look at this website and it still was really important and I still today even look at it and like I know, get inspiration and live my life better because of this website and the videos that they put on so it's extremely important. My story, <clears throat> anyway get into it, my story um, when I was about I don't know maybe in like last uh, two years of high school so 15 16 I was like starting to change like notice things like boys became like more attractive than girls I mean when I was in like early high school I thought you know obviously I was like girls like yeah girls they're a deadly attractive one you know I fancy girls but as soon as like I don't know maybe like I started to like notice, it's like the last two years and the exam years, I started to notice boys a lot more and, you know, I think it was probably the last year that I was like, am I really gay? Am I gay? You know, so, um, but I kept it to myself, you know, there was just one lad who I, who I liked in high school, but I didn't tell him and he still doesn't, well, he doesn't know now because I told him because he's still my best friend, but... I really liked him and he was, you know, but that was just a crush. I mean, we have, we all have crushes on people we can't have, you know, so. Um, like, a few years down the line, I got a job after school. Um, for, and I've been there for a long, long, long time. And um, in that job, I think it was like the second year there. Um, this lad started who I really, really fancied. And um, I won't say his name because it's you know it's not important. But the fact is, he was gay too, and he was more out than I was. And I was still in the closet, and I hadn't told a soul. But he could tell that I was, which was strange. I I didn't think that could happen. But obviously, gays have gay die, You know, they have that sense that you're gay. So basically, we hit it off, and we became really close friends. And you know, we started to do things like, not like rum or anything, but we started to have like kiss and cuddles and all that, you know, innocent, and it was really nice, and I was just thought to myself, I am definitely gay, I really, I fancy men, you know, but I still wasn't out, and two years after that, I was, I was struggling with my feelings, I, I, after the guy at work, he left, like six months later, it wasn't very long, and after that, he left, and I was back to square one and for two years I didn't see any other guys kept this this secret to myself and it ate me up inside I must admit it was the hardest thing because I knew I was gay but it was the hardest thing in the world to keep and I struggled for two nearly two years before I finally told my mum and my auntie um, just one day I said you know I'm gay and they were happy with that and then my dad found out and then it just grew from there. I started telling friends. They were cool with it. Um, my grandparents found out. They were cool with it. They're really, really supportive, you know. Um, so I think I've had the best experience as far as that's concerned. Um, I know, like, coming out is, like, sometimes it can go one way, sometimes it can go the other. But, you know, at the end of the day, you are your own person. You are an individual. And... Be who you want to be. Be yourself. Be strong. Live life to the fullest. You know, I'm the happiest person in the world. I'm, like, in a really strong relationship now. I've been out nearly for five years. I came out in 2007. I've been out for nearly five years in November. Just 
fantastic you know I'm I'm settling down sort of <laughs> and it's just really 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 good life is brilliant at the moment so you know if you're in the closet you know there's no rush to come out you can come out when you want but as long as you you know just be proud of who you are okay just be proud it gets better